So yun guys, bago tayo magsimula, just want to say na all of the tutorial lessons na pinagagawa natin, you can, um, yung mga code, the source codes, you can download them here. So, eto yung repository. So, yung link na nito is nasa description lang. So, you can click it nasa description. And, and also, thank you so much to, again, yung the first, the first, uh, person ever na nag-donate sa akin is si Madam Susan. So, basically, thank you so much for the donation. And, eto, uh, I bought it. Um, I bought um, kanina lang uh, new microphone. You know, as I've said, everything na is donated is for the improvement ng channel. So, eto, yun. So, hindi kasi gumagana yung isa kong microphone eh. So, yun, nasirata yung jack. So, yun. So, thank you so much again. So, eto, start of the video. In this video guys, pag-uusapan natin yung tinatawag ng mga Python data types. Yep, Python data types in Python. <laughs> Inulit ko lang. So basically guys, um, kayo, if meron na kayong language, I mean, meron na kayong language, meron na kayong um, alam in other languages, so basically, alam niyo na to eh. So, gusto ko lang, gusto ko lang to include ko sa mga beginners dyan, like, a quick review na rin. Because in Python kasi guys, lalo, lalo, lalong lalo na kapag nag- um, nag-a-assign tayo ng mga values sa mga variables. Hindi na, hindi na natin ini-specify kung ano yung data type. Eh. So, bato lang tayo ng bato. Gawa ng gawa lang tayo ng mga things without knowing kung ano yung mga dinalagay natin. So, it's uh, a good thing to know muna. I mean, at least a quick review kung ano yung mga gano, yung mga dinalagay natin. Kasi, importante rin yun. So, singit ko na rin um, on how to put comments in um, Python, so basically ganito so kung single line lang then just put the hashtag, then you put na, um, sa next na is your comment, kung ano man ang ganun so for multiple comments, just um, ilagay nyo lang sa loob ng opening and closing single quotation mark, which is tatlo siya, ganyan, so eto na nakalagay na, so you can just um, tingnan nyo na lang, so eto ang una natin i-consider dito so madali lang to, um, explain ko lang kung ano to, so basically 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 lima lang, so um, gawa tayo ng ganito, so i-print natin so, um, in Python una is the integer so ano ba yung integer, so basically integer, um, like for example 100, 200, 300, 400 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 so mga whole number yan guys yung mga whole number, hindi yan yung mga um, hindi yan yung mga tinatawag natin na mga, yung mga naka-decimal format ba yun? So, yung mga 10.2, 0.1. So, hindi yon It is not a integer. So, integer yung mga whole number lang. Like, 70, uh, 100, 200, yung mga whole number lang. So, whole number lang. So, paano natin i i malalaman in Python? So, basically, you can do this in Python. For example, gusto mo malaman yung type ng isang... Um, for example, yung isang data or isang object is, for example, gusto natin malaman yung type na, for example, is 80. So, we can print it um, class um, int. So, it's an integer um, data type. So, meaning etong 80 is an integer data type. So, um, you can use the type built-in function in Python kung gusto mong malaman yung data type ng ang tawag dyan, ng data mo. So, uh, by the way, meron ako dito Python file. So, you can just create um, or you can just listen na lang. <laughs> so, wala namang problema. Um, the next thing is, etong float um, double. So, for float, basically, dito na papasok yung mga 10.2, 100 points, uh, 100 points, 100.2, 0.1, 0.001, negative 0.1. So, by the way, sa integers ha, even negative numbers are considered to be integers. Basta whole number siya. So, for example, lagay ko dito si negative 80. So, um, integer pa rin siya. So, basta whole number. So, ganun rin sa float and double. Um, basta, basta yun may mga decimal places like 0. Yun nga, 1.5, ganun. So, gawin natin, for example, ganito is print um, type. type So, basically guys, in, so in Python, for example, 1.36. So, in Python guys, sinasabi niya na is float. It's a float data type. It's not Wala, um, in Python ata, hindi na nila, like, kino, inaano ang, like, gener, generalize na nila, nila, na to be, float na lang ang tawag, ganun. So, basically, pero ang, i-include ko rin, na ang difference ng float at saka double, is basically yung tinatawag, ano ang tawag na nakalimutan ko yung, ang, nakalimutan ko, basta, uh, ang float kasi, ang float, 
ang float can uh, after yung decimal places after ng decimal point yung decimal kasi is yung next do na numbers is only it can um store up to 7 digits for example 1 point um, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Float. Hanggang dyan lang ang float. So, 8, 9. Hindi na to float. This is not anymore a float. This is considered not to be a double data type. So, ang float is hanggang 7 lang. So, after the decimal place, itong, itong period na to. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Hanggang 7 lang. So, ang double, I think, is hanggang 15. Yep, 15. So, 7, 8, 9. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So, 1, ilan ba ito? 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, another number. So, hanggang it can store up to 15 um, digits after the ano. So, ganun lang naman. Um, uh, ganun lang naman yung ano ng um, float saka double L. Pero in Python nga, as I've said, in ano na nila eh, like in, ang tawag dyan na, just yung float na lang. So, what if ilagay ko to dito, print ba niya? So, yes. Because, as I've said, um, inano niya ng Python eh. Ayan. So, ganon. So, nakita niyo, di ba? Um, this, is, this is supposed to be um, double kasi ano, pero inano niya ng float kasi as I've said, ang um, Python like inano na rin na, na ano na lang na float yon. So, kumbaga tawagin na lang na isang thing or isang data type. Ganon. So, the next thing is the boolean data type. Data type. So, for boolean guys, dalawa lang, it's either um, true or false. So, that's it. So, wala, walang, wala, no more explanation. So, basically, it's either true or false. Yes or no. Oo o hindi. So, type, uh, for example, so, for you, um, for you to write um, true or false in Python, so, just type, yeah, true. So, for false, um, false. So, basically, let's also, uh, ano yung type niya? Yep the type so the, it's a bool so stands for boolean so ganun lang naman ang ano yung boolean so last but not the least is the um, string and character so ang string guys is basically ang string so anything that you put here um sa opening and closing tao dito double quotation marks is considered to be a string so ilagay anything you can put anything in here so ilagay niyo yung pangalan ng pangalan niyo, pangalan ng pusa niyo, aso niyo, jowa niyo kung meron kayo. <laughs> Ganoon so pang anything guys, anything like hello, your name, anything. So eh, basta always remember na anything na ilagay niyo dito is considered to be a string. Ganoon. So um pero gusto ko rin tong i-add up tong character. So in other languages kasi guys, um Gusto ko na rin niya i like i compare to, to other languages para ma, ma like ma, you know fam familiarize kayo like yung difference ng language na to, to other languages. So in in other languages kasi you do this like something like this ang um, character um for example C is equal to something like that. So eto kasi first I mean etong single quotation mark is for characters right so ang character is basically a single like ganito as in, isa lang isa lang so a string is multiple diba anything like ganyan so in ano kasi guys in python in python so basically you can print out ganito with the double quotation mark ganyan diba so pwede rin na pwede rin na yung single na lang Ganon. So, bakit ganito? So, in Python kasi, hindi naman, kina, hindi naman kinikilala ng Python ang character data type. So, kung makikita nyo, wala tayong, walang ganitong in Python na, example, ganito, print natin is class int. Wala, wala dito na class, uh, like, character. Walang kinikilala ang Python na character. So, eto, ang ninagay ko is, uh, ang character, walang character dito, pero all characters are just strings. Strings na sila. Ang type na nila is strings. Ganito. So, for example, ganito. Um, para makita nyo. So, for example, ganyan ito yung sinasabi ko. For example, ganyan. So, print ko. So, yan. So, wala ng character dito, guys. Walang character like sinasabi dito is character. So, all characters are strings with length 1. So, ganito. So, this is a string na. This is a string. Pero, alam natin, di ba? In our sa sarili natin na, yeah, oh, alam ko, this is a character, pero, Python, kinikilala ng Python, eto, 
sinasabi ng Python, oh, this is a string. Alam ko sa string to. Yan. Pero, of length 1. So, basically, ano ba yung length? Uh, length basically means kung like ilan yung character sa isang strings. For example, ganito ang uh, um, ano, uh, wala akong naisip na word. Standard. <laughs> yung naisip kong word. So, basically, yung length is yung 1, 2, oops, 1, 2, ganito lang. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, 8. Bali, ganun. So, parang yung yung length niya. Ganun. So, 8. 8. Bali, 8 letter, letters to. So, ganun, ganun lang, guys. Basically, that's it. So, tandaan nyo, tanda nyo lang yun in Python. You can do this. If you, you Again, if you want to print out um, strings, um, pwede nang ganito. A single. Ganyan. Single, quotation mark, gano'n. So, kapag, kung single kayo, di gawin nyo to. Kapag in a relationship kayo, din yung double. <laughs> Joke lang, guys. So, pero ako, um, to be honest, in my own personal thing, kapag alam kong like, ipiprint ako, ipiprint ko lang isang character, isang character lang, like ganyan. So, parang kinasanayan ko na pinapalit ang ginagawa, ginagawa kong ganyan. I don't know. Depende rin. It's up to you guys. Wala namang problema kung magpiprint kayo ng string, Tapos, single quotation mark lang. Walang problema. It still works. Walang, walang problema yan in Python. Ganon. So, yun guys. That's basically it. So, yun. A quick shout out. So, basically, not just a shout out. Um, ayaw kong sabihin na shout out guys. Kasi hindi nyo deserve na hanggang shout out lang for the support na binibigay nyo sa akin. So, ayaw kong sabihin na shout out lang. Gusto kong sabihin like a shout out. Super thank you. Shout out. Thank you, super to the duper. Thank you talaga. Yun. So, pumila ako ng our first top 10. So, thank you so much. I'm Russell um, Nabio. So, sorry if medyo di ko ma, like, ma-pronounce ng tama yung pangalan nyo. So, uh, sorry. Uh, I'll do my best talaga. So, Sandro um, Gra Gracilia. So, thank you so much, bro. Russell, thank you. And Jome... Jom, Jometerion Rabanillo. So, thank you so much, bro. And Darwin, um, Darwin, wait lang, Darwin, Bu, uh, is it I or L? Bulsa or Buiza? Uh, thank you so much, bro. Thank you so much sa'yo. So, Hendrix Rodriguez, Naim, ne, Naim, Mangkol Jr. And also, Crystal, Thank you so much, um, Naim and Crystal Relief. Relieve. <laughs> Sorry talaga guys. Pero you know, nakikita nyo naman yung names nyo. So, superb. Sad. So, thank you so much, bro. Um, Mabel Ryan and also Jerome Mayan. Yun. So, thank you so much, guys. Um, thank you for all the support. So, gagawin ko to like for every video, every top 10. Or maybe, depende, it could be top 10 or 20. Depende, I'll, ano, pero ito, which is the top 10. So, thank you guys, again, thank you so much, and thank you for the support. So, salamat sa mga new subscribers, thank you for the support. And guys, um, forever, um, like, you know, forever, thankful ako. Um, God bless sa inyo, you know, God bless, God bless. So, thank you so much, guys. You See you in the next tutorial.